And finally, students at Clinton Middle School are devouring a different kind of snack. 10 News reporter Sean Franklin explains. Feeding the body and feeding the mind. Well, I didn't really know it was going to be here until I was coming around the corner for lunch one day. Clinton Middle School's serving both. And I saw it and I was like, huh, it's got books in it. That's a little bit different. Just a little different from the snack machine. This one's got a few more words than a nutrition label. When you read more books, it like gets your mind going. It's a book vending machine. Just $1 gets you your book of choice. A lot of kids really like it. And it's like really convenient. Eighth grader Deshaun Mack picked up a book about Spider-Man. Student Riley Webb grabbed a book on Shrek. Books always expand your imagination. And nothing satisfies academic coach April Myers more than students using the machine. One student I asked, I was like, hey, have you tried the book bending machine? And they're like, can we really use that? I thought it was just a display. Nope, it's more than that. Myers sent a few emails and Five Star Food Service donated the machine. There's just a tremendous push to get kids on and above grade level for reading. The state's goal is to have 75% of Tennessee's third graders reading on grade level by 2025. Myers has that on the menu for her middle school students. So just providing incentives for them um, and hopefully this machine will be a part of that. That will hopefully help them take a bite out of everything that's out there to learn. Maybe it's not nutrition for your body, but certainly feeding your brain. In Clinton, Sean Franklin, 10 News. So mm. clever. The yes. books in the machine came from the library and donations from staff. Myers says she's working with the librarian to keep changing out a wide variety of books. That is awesome. Yes.